Hey everybody, it's me again, what's up? And in this video, I'm gonna show you guys the finished product of my 3D printed Iron Man suit. It's finally done. All right, as we can see here is the final product. Um, I got the eyes all lit up. Uh, the lights are uh, just some LED bulbs. Same with the arc reactor over there. Um, we're going to be doing a video tutorial on the, all the post-processing that I've done. Um, he's a little beat up right now because I wore him last night for Halloween. But, yep, here he is in all his full Iron Man glory. This is the MK47 from the Spider-Man Homecoming one. Um, I really like the silver and the red uh, going on there. It's really a nice break from just the uh, silver and or not just the red and gold um, He's basically the MK 46 just with a different paint scheme So we're going to try him on right now, and I'm going to show you the mobility So what I have on underneath here is just a silver morph suit that um, you can get on Amazon uh, it goes great with the um, the silver, so when you put this on, um, it blends in. It's, it's a great color, it goes perfect with it, it's fantastic. So, right, so let's put the rest of it on, and I'll show you guys what it looks like. So that's it. Um, that's the full Iron Man suit. Um, here's some clips and videos of me adding some special effects to it. Ready? Go. Those are so cheesy, but you know what? I had fun doing them here in my garage. Um, so, few few things. You can walk around in it. Um, put some padding on. Uh, some padding that you can get from Walmart. I'll be doing a video tutorial on everything that I did to it. Um, like padding, um, harness, all that other stuff. Uh, I learned a lot from it. There's a lot more that, that, uh, that needs to be done. A lot of tweaking. Um, using other materials that I should have used before instead of, you know, other stuff, um, painting, uh, a lot, I learned a lot about post-processing, so I'll be doing a video tutorial on that, I found the best ways to do post-processing, uh, what materials to use, what chemicals, um, print speed, and all that other stuff, so I'll be doing all of that um, here pretty soon. Um, the scaling was a little off uh, when I did the scaling prior to about two, three months ago, it was, I forgot to account that I was trying to put on a little bit more mass, especially in my legs, and I did. And so now I have to rescale it about 5% because it looks like I just try to squeeze into it. So um, with that said, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you liked the video, um, please give me a thumbs up down there. And if you want to subscribe for other videos, I'll be doing a playlist for the video tutorial on the Iron Man suit here pretty soon. Um, and also, I will be doing a lot of other um, video game stuff. Uh, I got some Destiny coming up, some more Iron Man, uh, maybe the next project's gonna be War Machine. So stay tuned, you guys. I'm gonna be putting up a website pretty soon. So um, 
I'll put that on the link down at the bottom. I'll also be putting down the links for everything that I used for the Iron Man suit down in the bottom, including in colors and all that other stuff. So again, if you guys like the video, thumbs up, please subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.